like clockwork. College baseball practice cranks up and the sleet starts falling again. I mean, it is January, right? But the season begins three weeks from today and the Commodores, per usual, are having to shrug off the elements. Getting back here, first training day. Uh, of course, it's cold. Uh, we kind of expected that. Yeah, snow or sleet during the Vandy boys' first week of practice is about as expected as, say, the team visiting Omaha in June. It's a regular occurrence. I don't know how much you can get used to this. I, I definitely know that once you train in it, that you are definitely better off for training in it. Just tell them to prepare for it. Once we get out here, there's there's no talk about it. They, they, they do a very good job of handling these types of situations. Call it another lesson in mental fortitude for a sport predicated on knowing how to react to situations. And the doors have learned well. 15 straight NCAA tournament appearances and spots in the College World Series in four of the last eight seasons. It always starts here in the cold of January, usually braving the elements. It is what it is. Um, we have tasks to complete. We have things to get done, and we just got to get them done. You kind of acknowledge at the beginning, and then once you get going, you don't really, you don't really think about it. You got to embrace it. You got to enjoy it, and uh, you're outside, and it's a whole lot better than, than last year's situation as a whole is just knowing that you know, we're in a kind of a more normal season now and looking forward to, to playing with having people in the stands. So everything's good. Hear, hear about that. And I love this. Maggie Corbin does not miss practice. The first lady of Andy baseball right there with him in the elements. The doors open the season again three weeks from today with a home series against Oklahoma State. I imagine.